Hello, good evening and welcome to Houseborn's World. Today is Sunday the 2nd of December. And although there's no Vlogmas this year, I am going to be trying to do some Christmas themed styled videos. So tonight on the channel, we're going to revisit H3, that's hot dogs, horseshoes and hand grenades. And we are not going to be in the VR gun range. This gun simulator game has got so much more to it but it is really suited to open scale room VR. In my setup, I really need a sensor on the other side, but until I can get a dedicated games room, I'm gonna to have to stick with a front facing sensor. But anyway, with this Christmas fun themed shoot 'em up, we're gonna be cracking some hot dog sausages. So let's get straight into it. <laughs> So we are here in H3 at the landing page. I don't think you guys normally see this because I've pretty much just gone into one of the modes. If I look up there, there's the indoor range. Now that's completely exciting for me, but not probably, probably so much fun for you. So with update 64, we have Meatmas. It's specially on for December. And in front of us, we have the Meatmas Capo Coliseum. But tonight we're going to be going to the Meatness Snow Globe. Um, let's load it up. So, hello and welcome to the Meatness Snow Globe. If we look up, we can see that it's snowing. We have snowflakes dangling from the ceiling. We have candy canes and Christmas trees and sweets and bells. In front of us we have our console which will load up in a minute but the main reason for wanting to do this today and if we look in front of us hopefully you can see as well as I can we have the Meatmas 2018 snow globe each day from December the 1st through to the 24th a new Meatmas advent box will be added somewhere in this uh, snow globe scene and in each of these we'll have an advent box so let's open box one and find out what's about to be revealed so i'm just going to crank that down let's just get back over there and we'll swing it round i'll stand back so you guys can get a good look and then we've got the sausage santas with us yes oh the guys have gone so the first Meatless Adventure Calendar box, we have an AR-10 battle rifle. It's got a 20 round magazine, it's come from the USA, and it's currently in use. And this has been uh, modelled by the artist Stefan Engdahl. So we're going to be using this in fighting the Sausage Santas. So I'm just going to pick this up, I'm going to load up a mag. We're going to get that cocked, ready to go. And I'm just going to turn that off and we'll put it into single fire mode. And then we're just going to holster that to the side of me. I'm also going to grab this magazine and I'll put it in my... Oh, dropped it. And I'll put it in one of my pockets ready to be used. So let's just orientate the right way around. And what I am going to do, we're just going to go and get a pistol ready to fight the Sausage Santas. Um, I think I'm just going to go with a modern uh, 1911 and we're going to spawn some ammunition for that. So I'm just going to pick that up. Let's pop a clip in. Let's cut that back ready to go. So we are hot, ready to fire. So what I'm going to do, pop that into there, and let's put some of these magazines in here, I'm ready to use. Uh, I'm going to leave it at that. Now, well, let's if I put the controls on, let's spin round. I'm going to take us over this way because we've just opened December the first box. So let's go down to here. So if you can see just down there, we have another loot box. 
uh, December the 2nd. And let's just work our way down to this one. And let's see what we get for December the 2nd. I'm going to pull this down. Let's just stand back so you guys can get a better view. Yeah, rocking with the Santas. December 2nd. <laughs> Oh my life, let's have a look at this then. Thank you very much guys. So in the Meet Miss Adventure calendar day 2, we have the FN 1906.25 calibre. And if we can pick this up, oh my god. This looks like it should be in a Christmas cracker. Look at this. This would be the type of thing that a woman perhaps would have put in her handbag. Uh, let's get it loaded up. So it is from Belgium. Uh, date of manufacture is 1906 to 1959. And the artist Darko Miladinovic has made this. Let's see if we can. Uh, let's pop it back. One's loaded, chambered. Right. This party gun. Can go off over there. We will quickly turn ourselves around. Let's get back up onto the platform. And let's go up and up and up. There we go. We're using the warp system, so I haven't got full scale room for the R. Actually, I should point that way a minute. I just want to show you these cannons. I'll turn that off. I'll hold on to that. We can actually use these to fight the sausage sensors, but for the minute, we're going to go and get them set up ready for the battle. Let's come over to the board here. So in front of us, we have the pepperoni battle spawner. So I'm going to basically set it up so that any of the sausages that spawn can have random weapons. We're going to put them at armor level 1. Human health settings. I'm going to put them sluggish because these little buggers move very quickly. We're going to say yes, they can use fast bullets. We only want to spawn five at a time. Now, to make this interesting, well, I'm going to put about 25. This could backfire on me, it could all go horribly wrong. Right, I can already see some coming in. Let's get the rifle. Let's get up into position here. And let's see if we can take some of these out. We've got one over there. One down. Perfect. Two down. Oh, we're being shot at. We're being shot at from the end of the game. We've got more making their way to the side. Let's get warp 
Putin, I don't know who that is. If we are the Putin there, we do have more coming up. Oh my god! Nothing coming up that side. Let's get further up. Actually, let's get to about. Oh no, we're out. Oh no, it's all so hard to do. Oh, we died. Oh no, a bit off more than I can chew. I gotta try that again. Panicked. It all went wrong. Let's get some more weapons. Ooh. Uh, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to go back. We're going to get Tactical 1911. Ooh, look at that beauty. That is nice. Uh, let's spawn some ammo for that. I'm going to try this again because we can't. We can't have the Santas beating us. The old sausage Santas. Let's, uh, let's try. What can we go for? Uh, we want an assault rifle. Let's have a scar. Mm. Right, spawn that. And we're going to have some huge magazines. So let's get this on and this clicked in. Let's get this loaded up. single shot. Now let's try this again. Let's turn ourselves around. Right, I'm going to set it so we can spawn two at a time. Let's, uh, we'll try about 26 again. Right, I can already see What I'm going to do, I'm going to get planked if I don't move. So I'm going to spin us around. Let's get up over here. So about here, let's get in there. And then we get in over there. We go. We're coming down here now, let's flank inside. Oh, I 
Horses shot there. This one in here. Nice. Oh no, you put me up this way. So we've actually beat all the spawn butts then. Well as you can see, this is quite a fun mode to play in. To hate true has got more than just the gun range. And this is just a Christmas themed video that I wanted to bring to you tonight. Let's uh, just come back out of this. I'll tell you what we'll do. She will turn them up. Shut that down. Let's click to the desktop. Well, that was H3 in the snow globe against the Christmas sausages. If I can get another sensor set up behind me, I'll have far more fun in this and I'll start bringing in more stuff in H3 because it really does need a larger room and at least sensors all around it. Hope you've enjoyed that. As I say, if you've not picked up H3 yet and you have got the Oculus or the Vive, go and check it out. It is really good fun. Um, as they reveal more Christmas crates, I'll uh, get an updated video on the channel. Bit of a mare tonight, uh, PC was playing up, I've been trying all night to record this video, but that you don't really need to know. Windows updates seem to fix the problem. But anyway, thank you for watching, and I will see you very, very soon in the next video. Thanks for watching. Good night.